been a while. What, six months since I last made you a video? Since that, that time, I have, uh, well, I've increased my following to a whopping 48 subscribers. I know. Uh, why have I been quiet for six months? What have I been doing? I must have been doing something really cool and interesting. Well, let me tell ya. That's not the case. I've been doing sweet naffle. Not even a peep of excitement. Uh, but today I'm going on a little road trip. So I thought I'd make a little vlog. What am I going to do? Let me tell it. I'm going down to my old uni town of Southampton where I met most of my friends. Uh, and I'm gonna do a calisthenics training instructor course. So then I can, well, legally teach people how to do a pull up, I suppose. I suppose that's what it boils down to. Uh, obviously, you need to get better at, at myself as well before I start preaching, innit? I've gotta practice what I preach and I don't practice it enough. So I've uh, mole pull-ups needed. Uh, so yeah, uh, this gonna be this gonna be my journey down now. Why right? was that out of focus, you stupid? F so basically, because my town is well, it's absolutely shocking to get out of like. 47 minutes, I'm still in my hometown. I had to stop off, get some snackings for the bloggings. And uh, it's the one thing I hate about when you go away for like a weekend and you're ill prepared and I'm always ill prepared because I start panicking that I'm not eating. Woo! That car nearly fucking hell. Not my fault. Uh, yeah, I start panicking. Thinking, oh no, macros, it's gotta get them in, which is quite sad, but I still panic. So, went to Tesco's, and obviously, you can get any food you want in a supermarket that you'd normally eat and be fine with. But when you're traveling, obviously, you can't cook, you ain't got a microwave, and I'm obviously gonna get a little treat tonight, and I'm obviously gonna go out for dinner, but that doesn't count. Uh, so, walking around Tesco's, I'm a bit ashamed of what I got on it. Uh, obviously, I went for the grenades, brownie flavour. I mean, there's, worse, there's definitely worse things you could eat, and grenades pretty good. And I will thoroughly enjoy it, but it's got all them uh, polyols in it, isn't it? Polyol carbohydrates, which basically you might as well eat plastic because your body do not absorb them, and it just goes straight through you. Too many polyols will have you holding on to that toilet seat for dear life, let me tell you. Not speaking from personal experience. Uh, dead sandwich. The deadest. Chicken mayo bacon. But like, it tastes bare gritty in your teeth, innit? Speed camera. Uh, what else I get? Water, obviously, but that's boring. And some apples. Organic, because for some reason they were actually cheaper than non-organic about time that's how it should be in it like why am i paying more for you doing less to it it's a cob uh, obviously uh, apples will give me that energy that i need tomorrow morning there's a uh, this course that i'm doing four hours long uh and basically it's all physical <sighs> uh, my gym sessions usually last an hour and a half absolute tops so they're gonna run me ragged tomorrow. Hopefully it's not flat out for four hours, that'd be criminal. Uh, but we'll see tomorrow, won't we? Welcome to my casa! Alright, so this is the bedroom. And the front room. And uh, the kitchen. Oh my god. Uh, uh, and uh, the master suite. Oh. It's a bit dunge. I bet I've got a nice view though. Oh! Sick! 
number 24. So that was the worst night's sleep ever on a main road. And to top it all off, chucking it down after a world good weather yesterday. So it's kind of thwarted my plans to take you to this bar set up they've got in Southampton because it's outdoors. So now there's really no footage at all. It's just me talking in the car. Uh, but my call starts in half hour. I've got to get there. They might let me film in there. I don't know. But uh, otherwise, this is all pointless, wouldn't it? Yeah. All right, in a bit. Course finished, certificate attained, and they did fully run me ragged. Somehow made a push up 20 times harder. Very good course. The guy that runs it, um, Owen, very humble guy, nice guy. I'll, uh, I'll link him up in the bottom, so if you wanna take his course and that, I highly recommend it, it's very good. Um, more on that later, but while I'm here, I thought I'd show you where it all began. 10 years ago, where uh, I met this guy, Ashley Joseph. Shout out, Ashley. Um, I met him in this house here, innit? That one right there. Looks like they're having some work done these days. Needed it back then, boy. Mushrooms going out the ceiling and that when I lived there. But anyway, yeah, I moved in there with this guy, Ashley, and he was the first guy that took me to the gym, so. If you think my videos are shit, you've got him to blame for this because he got me into the gym in the first place. Yeah. And uh, next door, number five. Any of the girls from number five ever watched this video? I got you, I got you. But yeah, that's it. That's me and Southampton done. Until next time. <laughs>